Welcome to another edition of My Opinion here on My Opinion TV. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and click the notification bell so as soon as a video is released, you'll be one of the first to be notified. And this morning we want to do a follow-up to a story. But first up, we want to talk about the situation with popular Jamaican dancehall artist Movado's son, Dante Brooks. And as it relates to that situation, Dante Brooks was found guilty um in yesterday's court and uh, just gonna read from the jamaica loop the legal team of dante brooks the son of jamaican dancer star movado plans to appeal the teenager's murder conviction which was handed down on wednesday asked if the defense asked if the defense uh planned to appeal the verdict attorney at law peter champagne replied with an emphatic absolutely now brooks 18 was also found guilty of illegal possession of firearm and arson in the home circuit court in downtown kingston his co-accused andre Hines was also found guilty now as you can remember the two were arrested and charged in connection with the the killing of lorenzo thomas in St. Andrew community of Cassava Peace on June 5 in 2018. According to prosecutors, Brooks and Irons were among five men who entered the house and shot Thomas before pushing his father into another room. Thomas killers reportedly attempted to sever his head but aborted the plan because the machete was too dull. They then allegedly poured gasoline on the house and the body before setting it them on fire prosecutors relied on the, the eyewitness testimony of thomas father who indicated he knew his son killers from the community well drag your memory back shortly before this incident it is alleged that movado was shot at and this is a reprisal to that incident that what we heard we can confirm or we can't deny but we know there was an incident where Movado was shot at and he seek refuge at the Constant Spring Police Station. DJ, some other DJs were getting involved. Remember there was a, a social media spot between Vibes Cartel who was incarcerated too and Movado when Cartel um, suggested that Movado should not look at him Vibes Cartel in any particular way because his son was also in the same place where he was. And I, you can remember at one point, Bounty Killer also said, Movado's son is a bad boy. So, even though Movado is rich, has been making a lot of money, right? His son, instead of trying to uplift himself, tried to get himself to dabble into the criminal underworld. Now, I don't know how his sentencing will go, but no doubt he'll be doing a good amount of time in prison and as peter champagne says they're going to appeal well let's see how far the appeal will take them but at the same breath what makes this case so unique and so easy to get around was that the deceased man's father was there at one point um they asked if they should kill thomas father and mavado son replied and said no right and based on what we heard the father heard about the plot to kill his son before and he was trying to get his son out but you know it's not everybody in jamaica can get up today or tomorrow and leave and go to a family member into another parish another community it's not just easy like that some persons really don't have anywhere to go some persons just don't have any family member to stay with and there might have been a possibility that arrangement was being made for him, Thomas, to leave. But at the end of the day, maybe it wasn't coming as quickly as how they anticipated. And that gave Movado's son, Dante Brooks, and Hines, um, Andre Hines, enough time to come and commit their act. And But we are hearing also, based on what we read from the department, the, the DPP office is that it was actually five men so we don't know what has happened to the other three persons that were fingered into this situation but all we know 
is that um, Dante Brooks will be sentenced and Dante Brooks and Andre Hines will be sentenced and I'm not sh too sure of the date when the sentencing will take place but I know very shortly they will be sentencing and it's a sad day I no doubt earlier um, this month my father um, penned a song in solidarity for his son but clearly it was too much the evidence was heavily stacked against Don Dante Brooks and he was found guilty but you can let me know what you think in the comment section and just to follow up the man who was being sought in relation to last week's murder of Latoya Alison Dorr, a popular Canadian events promoter in St. Anne, was arrested in Chelani on Tuesday. He was held sometime after 11 a.m. by the police personnel in the neighboring parish. In confirming the arrest, the St. Anne Police Superintendent Dwight Powell said the suspect is now in the custody of the St. Anne Police. He is being presently, presently questioned and the senior law, the, that's what the senior lawman reported. The suspect is to have been in a relationship with Alcindor up to the time of her death. Alcindor um, of Ontario, Ontario, Canada, was found with stab wounds or upper body at an apartment complex, which she reportedly rented in Runaway Bay on Thursday, January 21. Um, it led to persons or family members saying this man she traveled to jamaica to pursue business and to meet up with this guy who she was seen now after expressing all of their disbelief in their cousin's killing um persons reached out and the police started to do their investigation al sindur she's a mother of two she it was a promoter who heavily invested in making costumes for toronto caribbean festival popularly called Caribana and she came to Jamaica to do business and to meet up with this guy who she was dating but persons were always saying this guy was very possessive and that might have caused her demise but we glad the police have located this man they're doing their interrogation of him and we hope by the end of their interrogation the smoke will clear and we will see a much clearer picture of what happened. But nevertheless, let us know what you think in the comment section. Good job by the cops, right? But and a sad day for Mavara. But in Jamaica, we know if you do the crime, you got to do the time. But let me know what you think in this comment section. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click the notification bell. As soon as a video is released, you'll be one of the first to be notified. Help this channel as it seeks to grow and your subscription is very important in going a far way in helping this channel grow a little further but take care of the children look out for a loved one look out for a neighbor and always remember keep it locked on my opinion tv